Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. I've struggled with this question for, I feel like six months already, and it's actually super hard. Best rackets, best players rackets, best performance rackets, $100 or less. Oh my gosh. All right, coffee sponsor of today is from my coffee club, Jake Kasarian. Jake is part of my coffee club and hooks me up with one dark roast per month and continues to do so. So Jake, thank you so much for continuing to support the channel as a coffee club member. If you wanna be a coffee club member or just wanna hook me up with my dark roast of the day, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. If you don't want to hook me up with any coffee, you could just go to Super Thanks and just hook me up with something else if you like. All right, link is below. All right, thank you guys so much. All right, so I've pondered over this question and I'll read it to you. It comes from RSU Beasley and the subject title was best racket under a hundred dollars RSU Beasley writes hi there can you please tell me the best racket for an advanced player under a hundred dollars thank you very much and have a great day so it's it's an easy answer if you took out um, advanced player I mean Easily the best racket under $100 is probably that TIS-6 or TIS-5, but that's for the uh, recreational player. Um, so what's going on? Are there rackets that are under $100 that's meant for, let's say, a high intermediate advanced level player? Well, not really is my answer um, at the regular price level I mean I've searched far and wide I've gone to various websites I've talked to various people I was like hey what's your best racket for an advanced player that's a hundred dollars or less and I always get that same answer and it's a stall and I'm like oh and I can't think of it basically is what they're telling me uh, because what you think of in an advanced player's racket is Wilson Blade, Pro Staff, uh, Head Speed, maybe a Radical, Babolat Strike, uh, some of the vocals out there that are like a, like a PB10. Um, you know, it, it, it's, you think of these kind of like 10.6 and above weighted rackets that are slightly on a medium to thinner beam. And you think of them, but when you look at the price though, you, you see that 250 price tag and, and it's like, well, does anything exist in, in the $100 level? Well, I, my go-to place used to be um, the decathlon store and I would look at some of those Artengos the uh, the one that Daria Katsakina played with that 990 used to be 99.99 so I would be like that's a good one for you know if she could play with it she's an advanced player right then that would be your winner but unfortunately that is no longer 99.99 um, even in these days of inflation our tango had to raise their prices and it's in the 129 139 range now i mean i really love that new monfils racket that they developed that they have now in an 1820 and a 16 by 19 that tour and that is 159 so that would probably be your best regular price racket for an advanced player because you're not going to get something that good on a day-to-day, -day, on an everyday basis. Um, 
So what I really had to do was look far and wide and go super deep. And what I found was some interesting things and hopefully can give you some advice about how to shop for, um, let's say higher intermediate to advanced type of a player. Now, Head brought back out the XT series in the Speed MP and the Radical MP. Now the XT series was a line of rackets that came out, I want to say 10 to 12 years ago. Pretty popular back in the day. Uh, not too bad, actually. Um, I mean, compared to today, it was eh, but <laughs> back then it wasn't too bad. Um, and they're $99.99 and they're pretty strong. So you get a strong racket that's pretty good, right? Uh, and a high intermediate, maybe advanced level player could use that. And it is less than $100. Strong, even strong. So that makes it even better. I mean, that's what I could find. Now, some of the stuff that I've been looking at and researching um, and just being in the business, I know how this works. Most people who discount rackets that are discontinued, they don't really go down to a hundred bucks, I mean, or rarely. And when they do, it's kind of a, I want to say fire sale that they have way too many and they really have to get rid of them. And then they fall below that hundred dollar price point. Um, a couple that are actually on the market today, like literally right now, is, is the Dunlop FX500, the old one. So the, the new FX500 just got launched. The old one in some of the sites are $99.99. They're unstrung though, uh, but they're under $100. I've even seen it in some of the sites that they're an additional 25% off. So you can actually get this particular racket that's 10.6 ounces before string for essentially $75. I think that is a smoking deal if you if they're still out there. Okay. The other one is the SX300 series. And these are the same thing. They're $99.99 and you get an additional 25% off. So you can get these for the same price, $75. Again, it's 10.6 ounces. This one's meant for spin. This one's meant for plow. So kind of a pure drive-ish, kind of an arrow, a pure arrow-ish. And these both actually come in the tour versions, which are a 10.8 ounce version on 98 heads. So they're 98 square inch heads on a 10.8, which is very similar to that Alcarez racket, or maybe that Pure Strike. Um, my favorite, the Extreme Tour. Uh, if you can get those, I think we're at advanced uh, level. Okay, so, but, I mean, in order to find that $100 or less, you kind of have to be patient and on the lookout all the time. You have to I mean, see when a new racket's gonna come, and when it does, look at the old version. You know, the, uh, the gravities from head literally just went for 129. I don't see them anymore, but um, they went pretty quickly. So the new ones are 259, the old ones are 129. So that's half off. Um, not $100, but at least you get 50% off. So, but I mean, like what I tell you guys, go to, you know, thrift stores. You know, I found a blade for $6 and 99 cents. Um, you know, there's things out there that you can, you know, find like garage sales that, you know, you might find an older pro staff, an older strike, you know, so they are out there. Just be patient and be on the lookout. Um, eBay is a good place. 
they're not going to be new, or they may not be new, or they might have fallen off the truck, and then you can get them for 100 bucks. All right? Guys, good luck. Happy hunting. $100 or less. All right? Dunlops, XTs. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. All right, guys, are you looking for a coach, a pro? I know it's been super difficult looking for somebody out there to teach you. Now, I'm in the game myself, and it's super difficult to find somebody to, you know, teach you, somebody to hit with. Um, we know that the number one reason why people give up the game is because they can't find anybody to play with. And now you can't find anybody to teach you. Well, this is where play your court is going to give you a hand. All right, check out play your court. They have professionals. They have hitting partners. They even help you set up a game. The resources are there for you to keep you in the game of tennis. Go to playyourcourt.com forward slash tennis spin and get your own personal discount from me. Link is below. Stay in the game.